Welcome to another edition of Riffin' Right with David Wally. I'm Wally. And I'm Dave. So Dave, what are we talking about here today? We are talking about primerless cover tape. We are the first in the industry to have a primerless cover tape. So we don't need any primer. Bingo. Yeah. So that's going to save a lot of time and money on the roof. Absolutely. Right? Because we just eliminated one product you need to carry up there. Yep. So this is our standard cover tape, which requires a primer. Right. And this is the primerless cover tape, right? Right. There is a bit of a difference. The backing is one of the big the, differences. The standard has a paper backing. Right. The primerless has a vinyl clear plastic backing on it. Yes. There is a difference in the color of the butyl mm -hmm. somewhat. This is like a tannish color, and then we have a white. Mm-hmm. This brown here is just a paper. So. Right. So again, if you're ever not sure if what you have on your roof, especially if you're an inspector, that's one way to tell the difference. What's the warranty on this? 20 years. 20 years. And you said we can go up to what pitch on this? Three. 312, we had a 312 pitch on this. Right? Correct. What's the length of this roll? Six inch by 100 foot. 100 foot roll. Yep. So what's the process of installing this? First of all, it has to be cleaned. Okay. And we've already cleaned it. You can use our cleaner that we traditionally have or use our new aerosol. Perfect. Yeah. What about overlaps? Overlaps, make sure it's clean. Overlap at three inches, roll it, it's good. No primer, I don't need overlap here. When you're done, use your uh, cut edge sealant in an H pattern. At and the overlap areas, right. what about inside, any outside, inside or outside corners, same thing? Well, I mean, if you're over here, yeah, you would do like you traditionally do, but you don't have to do the edges. Correct. So yeah. just, yeah. Cut it ceiling. So to set this, so we're kind of, we'll lay this out here. I mean, how far out do we want this from the edge of the middle? Do we want it back from the edge? What's a good well, way you to set this? Well, you obviously want to cover the fasteners. Correct. Right, fastener heads. I just take it right out to the edge where your liner is. So kind of use your butyl tape and your yeah. liner as a guide. Absolutely. Because you don't want it hanging over, right? No, 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 no. Yeah. All right, so we've already cleaned this material mm -hmm. or this, this metal edging. Right. So let's go ahead and set it. Yep. Ooh. Zap, zowie, and swish. Okay, set it right out to the top. There we go. Set it. Now, is there any certain way you'd like to see you guys roll this at a 45? 45, I mean, that's what they do now, so. I'll let you do that. So again, we have a tape overlap here, so if you can visualize, maybe we're doing a couple hundred feet, like this is the end of my run, or I got an out, inside or outside corner. Again, we do not need any primer on this, right? Correct. So I can take primer's cover tape and just overlap that. You can lay it in, roll it. That's pretty much all there is to it, correct? Temperature restrictions on this. 20 degrees and rising. You know, when you're doing these corners, these overlaps. Or butt ends or whatever. Butt ends, always clean it, even Regardless. if it's clean. Yeah. Even if it's clean, always clean it. Always clean it. That way you'll never forget, nothing will ever happen bad. Perfect. Stay tuned for other videos at gif.com slash roofing it right.